This is our family. My name is Rachel. I'm married to Daniel and our daughter is Phoebe. Join us as I document our life. We are the Heckmans. We are at Kristen Bosch Botanical Gardens this morning. We're gonna walk around and um, look at the gardens and maybe get some food and go shopping in this gift shop because I already see things that I want. Uh, Phoebe is here in the stroller. Can you say hi? Are you gonna take a nap in the stroller for mm -hmm. mama? Are you gonna take a nap for mama? Mm -hmm. No, I'm too busy getting my sock off. Okay, let's go. I'm taking Daniel and Phoebe to show them the coolest tree that um, used to play on as kids. And Daniel's in heaven. He basically feels like he's in Jurassic World. But I don't know if you can see on this camera very well, but it's like just a web of trees. It's so cool. And it goes on like really far in that direction and it's just like a maze. I probably shouldn't be trying to climb on this while I'm holding her, but um, yeah, I just, I just want to explore. She just wants to get down so bad. Oh my gosh, she's gonna be such a little adventurer. It doesn't look like it, but this hill is killer. We are really getting our workout in. Oh, is that what my hair looks like? Um, it's not so much the hell as much as we're just really out of shape. Speak for yourself. <laughs> no, I'm the most out of shape. Um, we're trying to find the Proteas, but uh, stopped seeing signs and I never saw any Proteas. So that's encouraging. Um, here's some signs about wildlife. Cool, cool, cool. We're really hoping Phoebe's gonna take a nap in the stroller, but um, that's kind of a hard expectation considering there's so many really cool things to look at. I can understand why she's not exactly napping. Um, yeah, I guess we missed the proteas. Still beautiful though. Oh, apparently they're up here. Um, we've been really enjoying our time in South Africa. And uh, in some ways it's kind of odd for me being back because it's so familiar. But it's, I definitely see everything kind of from a new perspective through the eyes of Daniel and Phoebe. But also it's like different being back now having Phoebe, like my whole life has changed so dramatically and just like doing anything like going grocery shopping is just very different than how it was the last time I was here. So it's been kind of an adjustment. I think the first week we were here, we were just recovering from the journey, <laughs> the plane ride, and we didn't really take on like any extra <laughs> Um, adventures and then the second week we we're here we we're mainly focusing on wedding stuff and so this is our third week and um, we've been really taking advantage and like getting out and about is this Persia? who can say um, and then we only have one more week and we're leaving so sometimes when you travel it takes a lot longer to like adjust when you have a baby um, but we've really, really been enjoying it. And we come places here, like the botanical gardens, and I just think like how awesome it was growing up here and playing on, um, playing like in the gardens and everything. And I just think about like Phoebe's upbringing and how much I would love for her to have that same experience. But um, it's in the Lord's hands. We'll see, how, see what happens. Uh-oh, I'm losing a Daniel and a Phoebe. They're going in the bush.
um, are at Misenberg Beach and Phoebe is loving the beach life. Say hello. Hi. It's so cute to see her exploring and engaging and figuring out the world around her. She loves the beach. I took her down to the beach the, the other day and uh, we were just playing in the shallow water and she was finding all the shells and eating the sand and it was really cute and really fun. got very involved in the uh, beach experience so we are resorting to <laughs> changing her on the, at the back of the car and um, I think she's a beach girl she loves it you love it it's so fun isn't it yay I love the beach this is parent life so fun cheers Oh, whoops. Oh. Cheers. Oh, don't actually do it. <laughs> Gross. <laughs>